Hello, and welcome back to South Park, the Stick, Untru er, the stick of Truth, not the Stick Untruth. Um, my name's Zeke. If you're texting your friends about you the game, tell it's good. Um, but yeah, last time on the episode, we helped. I finally beat the tweakers, and then I took the coffee to the tweak. That's pretty much all I did. I explored some houses and stuff. So, here we go. Let's... I already talked to him. How's it feel to totally not be able to see any Terry and Philip movie? Oh yeah? I'm gonna go in. <laughs> they didn't stop me. You're being rude. Rob Schneider, derp de derp. I am Damien, the Antichrist, the son of Satan, and I have never witnessed a thing as hideous and vile as the one you mortals call Rob Schneider. Derp de derp. Derp. Coming this summer, it's the classic film that changed America. E.T. the Extraterrestrial, the new redone version for 2002. All the E.T. effects have been digitally upgraded. All the guns have been digitally changed to walkie-talkies. And the word terrorist has been changed to hippie. <sighs> Oh, it's, it's just it's the trains. motion picture that changed America. Saving Private Ryan, the re-re-release, where the word Nazi has been changed to persons with political differences, and all the guns have been replaced by walkie-talkies. It's like totally awesome to be mature like me and not immature like you twerps. Die, asshole! Then you die. Oh. Uh, are you going to rape us? <laughs> Hope not. <laughs> My phone went off. Come on! Feel my righteous fury! You'll get at your best shot, and that's all Jesus asks of you. Ow. You should take me mud. I wish I had some Frank. I like the stapler. I thought it was some of Rob Schneider's better work. For the life of me, I can't explain how I keep losing all my underpants. It's the gnomes, I tell ya. This is where I need to go token. Hey. Oh. If you try again, I will pepper spray you back to the Stone Age. Well, that's not cool. I'm gonna sue you. <laughs> oh, looks like I need to go to Jimbo's. Jimbo's. Oh my gosh, is that him way over here? Oh my goodness. That's 
quite the run. Okay. Some kids gave me the worst pink belly over there one time. Stan one time gave me the grossest wet willy right here. Jim Pokemon. Oh, it's frozen. Ugh. Hey, kindergartner. I couldn't decide where to hide. Die, asshole! No! Jimbo and Ned. Well, howdy there. Haven't seen you before. You must be the new kid that moved to town. And you're into hunting, huh? Well, my boy, you've come to the right place. South Park is chock full of things to shoot that would delight any taxidermist, survivalist, or weekend animal death enthusiast. Ain't much I can sell to a miner, thanks to... Yes, that's what I need. Sweet. You remind me of a guy I served with in Nam. A guide to South Park Wildlife is everything a hunter needs to know about the beasts of Central Colorado. Got some things for sale might help. We'll buy the guide to wildlife. Strap off. You kill anything in that guide, you come back and see old Jimbo and Ned. The best part of hunting is bragging about it to other hunters. It's this way. Moldy sausage. What? Hey, why is Kenny's dad over here? Who? What? Oh, hey, I guess I hit it a little hard at the bar this morning. Thanks for waking me up, kid. You on Facebook? <laughs> This protein. What are you looking at, pussy? Not that. If you want to see that, there's an orange house. Stay out of the lost forest. Sure, it's got treasure, but they say there's no. Oh! Shut up. I'm violent. I warn you, sir, I have five years training at the mall. Move. What the fuck? Oh, no. That's right. Ah, shit. Forest. Sure, it's got treasure. Ah! Oh! Sure. I think. Oh, I didn't take it off.
I don't know what those little robot things are. I remember them from some episode, but I don't remember what they are. Hey, that's Cartman's hat. Pokemon. Yeah? Can I help you? Oh yeah, I have a letter for you. There you go. <laughs> What's this? Oh, the elf stick the stick again? Hang on a second. Thank oh, you for thy message, fast. traveler. I shall make haste to Koopa Keep. Mom, can you drive me to Eric's house? Move along, sir. I can't look at you without feelings of deep personal shame. <laughs> Cartman's. Oh. Well, soldiers reporting for duty, Grand Wizard. Nice work, douchebag. Now all my men are here and ready to fight for the. Wait a minute. Where's Feldspar? Where's my level 12 thief? Uh, hey, yeah. Where's Craig? He's in detention. What? He flipped off the principal, so he's in detention again. Oh, my God. If they've locked away our thief in detention, we have no hope of getting back the Stick of Truth. We have to break him out. Ah, no way, man. Last time we broke Craig out of detention, we all got in trouble. Getting into trouble is a risk that Douchebag is willing to take. You have to break out our thief, Douchebag. But don't worry, I will not let you go unprepared. I'm going to teach you how to use magic. Meet me at the training barracks. It's time for you to learn Dragon Shout. <laughs> um, I didn't know I was playing Skyrim. Oh, I think I have another perk, too. Abilities, perks. <laughs> There's a matter that requires my attention. Let's do that. You fight well, douchebag. But to truly succeed in combat, you must learn to harness the power of your farts. <laughs> Farting on an opponent at precisely the right time is key to battle. I shall show you how it's done, but first, you must take the gentleman's oath. You must promise to never, ever fart on anyone's bows, okay? Farting on an opponent is necessary, but farting on someone's bows is not cool. <sighs> how you would understand? I even do that? All right, then let's begin your training. To conjure dragon shouts, you must first clear your mind and take in a deep breath through your butthole. Like so. Hey, then let it rumble inside you and drag it out. I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Drag it out. <laughs> now you ready? Drag it out. Find the frequency. Hold. Hold. Oh. Whoa! Don't leave the air trapped inside. That shit's dangerous. People die like that. <laughs> I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Dragon shout! Now you. Ready? Dragon shout! Find the frequency. Hold. Hold. My god, that was incredible. A man could live a hundred years and never again witness a spell so boisterous. <laughs> could it be that the prophecies are true? Could it be that the dragonborn has come at last in our hour of need? Now let us try your skill on a real opponent. Hey! Hey, Princess Kenny! <laughs> Could you come here a sec? <laughs> Shh, don't okay. Just real quick, Princess Kenny. Sir Douchebag wants to show you something. All right, you two. Spar! Sir Douchebag, show Princess Kenny the magical powers I have taught you. <laughs> ha! <laughs> that was fucking <laughs> hilarious! <laughs> Dude, that was fucking hilarious! 
fucking awesome! <laughs> oh, okay, good job, sir, douchebag. That was sweet. Thanks, Princess Kenny. That's all for now. Cool, cool, asshole. I think okay, I understood but, that. Dude, seriously, remember, don't ever do that on someone's boss, okay? Seriously. You have mastered dragon shaft. From now on, it will be easier for you. Kenny will assist you on your quest, douchebag. Now go get Craig while I rest and relax upon my throne. Well, that looks like a good place to end for now. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Thanks. Thank you.